So, out of New York studio, Lorenzo. I own Complexion Model, Complexion Magazine, and um, Gallery 201, out of New York studio. For the first time, I met a Guyanese guy I actually grew up with. We grew up with him, but same village. I'm from Auburn Front. I just spent my summer vacation in Blackbush in New Amsterdam. So, New Amsterdam and the end friendship. And, um, what's it called? Uh, um, Bushlight. 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 And he grew up here. Yeah, man. But I remember, I left here, I left 87 Guyana. I was 12 years old, and I remember everything about Guyana. I'm going back for the first time in 30 years to take care of my house and I'll be in front of family with people living on it. But I want a good curry. And this man gonna hook me up to a good guy in the street. Even Hasa, you said about Hasa. I haven't had Hasa in like. You guys tell them. Tell them about my curry. I'm gonna learn, I need to live in West. Uh, Newark. Newark. I live in West Orange now. And you just we're neighbors. We're neighbors. It's still a small world. Damn. I'm so happy. I met you. Cheers. Cheers. One first 2023. One first 2023. Josie. 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 Hello everyone. Welcome back to the channel. It's your local family with Rita and Krishna. I hope everyone is having a good day. Thank you in advance for watching and we hope that you enjoy this video. Please subscribe to our channel and share with everyone. Hello, hello everyone. How is everyone doing? Good afternoon, good afternoon. Good evening, good evening. Yes, evening time. Yep, yep. So me and Rita are bringing her to a wine fest here. Rita, happy place, right? <laughs> <laughs> I'm here just to accompany her. She's going to have all the fun tonight. So let's go. And listen guys, it's, mm -hmm. it's crazy. It's summer. And it's freezing cold, freezing cold. I don't know what kind of summer is this. And it's supposed to rain, right? We expect a lot of rain and this yeah. thing is outdoors. Look, so let's look see. How we have to dress. This is not bad. So let's see what's gonna happen. It's real cold. I feel like you bring jacket. I brought my jacket too. <laughs> I ain't taking no chances. Alright. Ready for this? Ready so to have some fun? Let's have fun together. Enjoy. <laughs> don't take my pizza to hold me. <laughs> yeah. You take my okay, then give me a hug. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, lovely boss. Okay. See you in the lane. Hello. We're scanning our tickets again. Yeah, I'll set. We're getting her, getting her ticket on. Thank you. Krishna, where are you going? Oh, wash it out. Cheers guys. Wine Fest 2023. How is it? Good, good. Go ahead. Try what it. is the name? Um, White Heaven. White Heaven? Okay. White Heaven wine. This is heaven. <laughs> so we got Rita gonna do a taste of her wine there. Come on Rita, let's go. And listen, I haven't drank alcohol almost two weeks, so I don't know. Good? It tastes like peach. Peach. Cheers, cheers. Happy birthday. Cheers, Friday. cheers. So I was better over the strange side.
Rita's trying, Rita's trying. What are you trying, Rita? How is it? Good? So how is it, you said? Alright, enjoy, enjoy. Okay. <laughs> you wanna go put a bit here, Krishna? Oh, you wanna put a bit? What do we have here? Michael Jordan. How you doing? How you guys doing? Good, sir. How are you? Okay, so we raised money for the um, the um, line. So we raised money for the uh, NYPD and the New Jersey cops. Hear what he's saying. Okay. So you know we raised money for the uh, New Jersey cops and the NYPD. The people who got hurt in or hurt out in action, or who lost the loved ones who, who just passed away, we raised money for them. Right now we do it. We used to, you know, we always do a silent auction, but right now we do it at five now. So you buy it right now, you, you can put it in the car right now. Oh, oh, we can ship it to you too. We can ship it to you. Yep. We okay, so what are we selling? Lost singers, a lot of um. <laughs> <laughs> There's two. We got a bunch of them. Give you like a certificate, like we give you like something that says like it's from this person, like JSA. That's a real company. You signed all this. Oh, so let me go to meet these. Like, like this, like, like all these, like this, like you know those stickers, right here, and it shows how like that it's real and all that. Yeah. And it's all real, guy. You put in your bid and they ship it. Okay. This is more action stuff here. So the action for this uh, picture start at uh, 1200. Minimum bid is 1200 and above. Who we got? Derek Jeter, Jorge Posada, Mariano Rivera, and Andy Petit. If you're a baseball fan, for $1,200 for this, and it's a master tournament. If you're into golf like me, you pay $375. This picture started. Okay, look what we got here. Cookie. Rita is gonna try bang bang cookie. Which one? Bang bang cookies. Remember the delicious the cookie? 
Okay, Rita's gonna Whoa. try chocolate chips cookie. cookie. Look what I got here, chocolate chip cookie sample. Okay, sunlight. Um, I'm trying to scan them. I know you eat good anyway, so I'm getting a free sample and then I'm gonna buy all the for one that I need. Taste and buy. Good, good. Yes, so we're getting the bang bang cookie. That's the what is that? A coconut? So I'm gonna make a nice one. The cinnamon. So I got bang bang cookie here. What flavor I got? It's coconut. Coco Paradise cookie. So I'm gonna eat this later on. I'm not too hungry yet. So I'll let Rita try this later. So I'll make Rita eat cookie tonight. We're gonna be a fan of cookie. All right. So here we go. Here we have Johnny and his pot. In case you drink too much wine, and you gotta go, right? So this is the atmosphere here, it's still building up, it's still building up. People are still coming in, there's a line out there for coming. The line is getting long, oh man, we made it in. Oh, you see? Yeah. It's over here, So this is what's going on here. Hope the weather behave itself tonight. And look what's going on, it's a lot of cloud. We can't even see the Freedom Tower, let's see. If we zoom in. So the crowd is building up nicely. And we have a, a lot of food truck and stuff, food truck option. So wine, empanadas, enter to win whole food shopping cart, $1,000. That's a ripoff, remember we did that? <laughs> you know what I'm getting? You want something from the food truck or should I make it before the people come in? No, I'm good. So this is some atmosphere more here. option over there so we got hot sauce over there we're gonna go try some hot sauce let's go check out the hot sauce Basil, garlic, cilantro, combination both. These are mild. <laughs> this is medium. Mild, medium, moderate. The salsa verde, serranos, tomatillos, lemongrass, ginger, and then big or even habanero. It's all about flavor. If you use any hot sauce at home, it's going to be hotter than it's going to have the flavor. Please, I've got chips there or spoons there. We're going to work for you. So this is our original. We started 12 years ago. We're out of the Cape Bay area of New Jersey. This is all cilantro, chilies, cayenne, garlic. Get the hottest one, Krishna. What do you like? Which one is the hottest? The hottest one. So these two are the hottest. They're all habanero based. This one will hit you right away. Try that one first. Because it's all about the pepper. It's all about the smoke and the tanginess of the pepper. We're not here to burn you away. We're here for flavor. That's all garlic, whiskey, and butter, and then the habanero. And that's more of a building heat.
No, because you should have got a different one. And I will say, it tastes delicious. It's delicious? Oh, yes. Very much so. Make. <laughs> I don't know, you tell me. Alright guys, so everybody out here drinking wine, I hope, and eating some good food. <laughs> Cheers! Yeah. yeah, it's good. Yeah. It's good? I would hope so. Trick questions. <laughs> so I'm gonna hang out here all night tonight and drink beer. <laughs> <laughs> Finish up the whole bottle. Bad for days, girl. Oh, this is a bottle. Cheers. 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 Good. All right, so you're gonna stick around right here. This is your spot. You find your spot. Look, we got wet so pretzel. Or not pretzel. Sangria. Better way. We take it to red sangria. How is how is it going? Good. I remember him from last year. Okay. How is the sangria? All right. So it's not only wine, right? You get sangria too. All right. Good mixture. And I got my beer going. So cheers, cheers. All right, we take like the red one, so much you go with the white one now. Good, cheers. Wow. Is that who margarita? All right, so we're gonna try some margarita now. It's cookie dough whiskey. It's a craft hand salsa. It's a lot of selection here, right? So we're gonna come. A lot of selection, a lot of selection for the place get dark and rain start from now. Here, a lot of people over here. Here we got the world's first naturally blue wine. We're gonna go try out the blue wine. This is natural blue wine, right? So we're gonna go try that. Rita, how is it going? You having a blast? Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Oh. I didn't drink it. Last week you said you were fighting with a big auntie. Yeah, but I didn't drink. <laughs> All right, cheers, cheers. Hello, Salinas. I'm the beer in-house song and producer today. And not only am I going to be breaking down six different wines for you, I'm going to be breaking them down in the aromatics, the palate, and also the regions and structure that these wines are going to be joining in. Uh, can you hear me okay back there? Oh, fantastic. I try to always bring the microphone because I'm always battling out the band over there. So, yes. So, here we go. I'm first going to start with Yachi Blanc, which is going to come from the Monticello region of Virginia. And the style of this wine is going to be very much similar to if you're enjoying, say, like a New Zealand Sauvignon Blanc. Minus the mineralistic and slaty composition of the terroir that you mostly would get with those wines. You're going to find that this is going to be more of a fruit forward approach. 
and realistically on the palette you're going to find that it's going to be more drier riper tropical stone fruit so maybe a little bit of pineapple a little bit of fresh cut nectar possibly a little bit of passion fruit and mango and melon are going to be initially on the palette now again very light very structured balance and not too slaty and mineralistic of what you would have when you're dealing with your white wine Again, also the clarity is almost non-existent because there was hardly no skin contact that was placed on the Southern Rome. So that's why you're going to find that it's not going to have that tannin structure that you most of the have. Now, moving right along to a very interesting and complex type of wine here. Yes, Amour Genev is the world's first naturally blue wine. Now, not to get confused with these other wines that you see, but this is a natural composition of anthocyanin and phenol from this great Barado that you see right here. Now, this is a Trebbiano, Verduzzo, and Chardonnay composition, but this great Barado is a Nebbiolo, which Nebbiolo is going to come from the region of Piedmont, Italy. Now, after malagactic fermentation and deposition of the skins of this grape, there's two main compositions that are separated from the skins, which is anthocyanin and phenol. Now, most of these type of compositions are mostly found in horticulture, but since we wanted to pull it from the skins of Nebbiolo grape, transitioning the pH range from an acidic level of a 3.5, alkylated composition of base, through the process of titration allows the blue color not only to stabilize but also allows individuals that have acid reflux, Crohn's disease, esophagus lining issues, things of that nature to be able to actually consume the product because you're going to find that it is going to find around a 4.5 or 5.4 on the actual pH scale which not only allows that blue color to stabilize and not be affected through oxidation but it also allows that light subtle composition to be able to still hold the acidic level that it mostly lost from the beginning phase of that transition but also allows it to take on that more subtle approach with that white wine stuff. all right blue natural wine blue natural wine let me see how we take it there Snap, moving right along good Blue natural wine is good. Anybody enjoys today. Tiffany is going to be taking orders right to the right of me over here. Uh, she's going to be having them delivered right to your home uh, since you don't have to carry them off the premises today. Uh, so this next wine I'm going to be sharing with you all today is going to be Parami. And it is going to be a Treviano, Verduzzo, and Chardonnay as well. And the style of this wine is going to be more of a French Giotorta or a Blaudo Vietnam Prosecco. It is going to be just light enough to take on what you normally would do as an aperitif or whether you utilize it as a dessert wine, or if you want to have it with, say, a nice pad thai, or possibly curry, because again, this is going to be more of a semi-sweet composition. You're going to find that mostly when you're doing your sweeter wines, you're going to want to transition and balance your spice. Okay, next wine, next wine. Next wine, next wine, next one, next one, next one, next one let me go, go quick. You can go with a Granny Smith Apple Pie of the Mode, which again, on the palate, you're going to get that Granny Good. Smith. Very, very attractive. All right, so we're going to place our order next, next door. It's going to be a Treviano, Verduzzo, and Chardonnay in this beautiful wine. Absolutely. Now, the next wine I'm going to share with everybody here is going to be a Moscato di Asti from the Asti region of Italy, allocated also with Emilio Romano now, the style of this next one is going to be more of an Italian presente, which is Italiano for sparkling. You're going to find that the transition of this wine is going to be just light enough to be able to take on if you're doing, say, like a mango chutney salmon. Or if you're going to be doing something, say, mm, your brunch meal, the chicken and waffle. Or possibly if you're going to be doing something, say, like a curry. Because again, this is going to be more curry, of a, this is uh, curry, 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 and curry, curry. Now, again, the style of this <laughs> All right, let me go. Let me hear you. Curry, 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 let me go. And again, for a peach <laughs> approach. Because this is going to be developed with Emilio Romano. You have sakori today, so I guess you go well good. Good? Go good if you have sakori? Nice. Those type of foods. But again, the style of this is going to come from the Emilio Romano peach cores, aged in Moscato Giasti, and that is what you get. Now, the next wine I'm going to share with you all today is going to be from Monticello. We're going back to Virginia again. And I'm going to share with you a Merlot, which is going to be a 2021 Merlot, 
and it realistically the style of this wine is going to be a little, bless you, is going to be slightly a little bit more on the smoother and more velvier composition. I think it's like My kind of wine, my kind of wine. Santa Barbara Pinot Noir. It's going to be just as light as what you normally would have if you're doing, a, say, a Delmonico steak or if you're doing something, say, like a wrap of a lamb. You're going to find that it's going to be just light enough to be able to pair with those compositions. Toasted oak, light vanilla, you're possibly going to get a little bit of ripe. Alright, we're going to eat lamb, so we're going to drink this one with lamb. When it comes down to that level, we're going to have lucky girl. You're going to taste some, alright? No, I'm going to hold the tongue. I'm going to right here which is going to be a petite verdot merlot and cabernet sauvignon you're going to find that the structure of this wine is going to be a little bit more smokier on the composition but you're going to find that it's because of the bourbon barrel aging that's similar to a pinotage composition from south africa but it is going to give a little bit more of that more lighter smokier and structure composition which allows it to pair extraordinarily well if you're doing a brisket or if you're doing a rack of ribs just nice enough to be able to have that subtle style of sipping wine, but also I would say it would pair extraordinarily well with your barbecue. Good? Not too overbearing, not too overbearing. We got drinking wine, and we got freedom tower in the background there. Cheers, cheers. But ladies and gentlemen, that does conclude my tasting today. Again, my name is Coviello Salinas. Again, please make sure you scan our mailing list right here for our event production to make sure you follow our journey and also make sure we get to follow you because we like giving free stuff to our people that uh, join us at our event. Also, if you enjoy anything that you tried today, visit Young Tiffany and she will have it directly mailed to your front doorstep in the next few days, uh, getting ready for your July or whatever uh, holiday you're sharing. But I greatly appreciate you guys. And so look what's going on, look what's going on over here. This thing is picking up real nice. And we got some nice background here. We got New York City in the background here. We got Freedom Tower. And look, it's starting to pick up real good. A lot of people, I'm surprised. And the weather was supposed to be bad, so I guess the rain is staying away. No, because they're smart. They say how it's not refundable. And we bought the tickets from a while ago. Because I look forward for these events. Yeah man, so how are you liking it so far? I'm loving it, I'm loving it, I'm loving it. Nice, nice, enjoy. Alright guys, so we're gonna go drink up some wine and so and we're gonna check in back with you guys later on, alright? Stay tuned, so we're wait till the light come on, so we're gonna get the New York City background later on. <laughs> So look what's going on here, all the food truck, line busy, busy, man, and people get hungry. <laughs> Rita, join the line, y'all. No meat, meat, brown rice, one people come. Over here is the food section. We gotta go try food just now. Uh, I'll be normally a big drink, I'll be not a big eater. Right? What do you say? How is it going? How is it going? Having a good time? It's mango, mango wine. Delicious! Unfortunately, I can't drink with you, sorry. Yes, yes, look what's going on. Food smells good. We're gonna try it out in a little bit, right? I'm and we got the background, background clearing out there. Yes, real nice, real nice. I just don't know them off the top of my head. Yeah. Yeah. A lot of Indian guys on the first one. The only kind you guys have that we can 100%. Yeah, right now we have just one that we're working If you can't find us, just email us if you find us online. Cheers. Oh, nice. This is our Basmati rice one. Okay. Good with basmati rice. Same one. Yeah. So it's Indian basmati rice. It's very light and smooth, easy to drink. Yeah, I like basmati rice, so maybe this is gonna go good. <laughs>
Where are you from? Guyana. Oh, you know, a lot of Guyanese people here I'm seeing today. Yeah? Yeah. And her name is Basmati. <laughs> yes, your name is Basmati. <laughs> wow. <laughs> there you go. Double on the lot of events. Yes. So, yeah. you gotta get the beer. Where can I find this beer? Where are you in New, in New Jersey? Yeah. We're in like a uh, total line, Whole Foods, uh, liquor stores, buy right, Indian restaurants. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Cheers. 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 Basmati. It's good. It's good. Yes, yes, look at the Manhattan skyline there. Weather started to clear up now. We got a nice view of the Freedom Tower there, right? Amazing view. Check it out, check it out. Are we here by Liberty State Park, right? Liberty State Park area. Liberty State Park is that way. So we're a part of it. We got Rita there. How are we doing? Rita got Chardonnay there, right? And look at people here. And look at us here. We got backstage pass for the concert. Yes. Backstage, oh, backstage VIP. pass. VIP backstage pass here. So then guys, take a break. Now they're setting up back. And this is the Jersey City skyline on this side. And look at this uh, wine fest here. What's going on here? Look what's going on here. Look what's going on here. Look at the fun here and the craziness. A lot of people here coming out to enjoy themselves. I guess the weather behaving, the weather behaving. And they figure out one like to live, right? One life to live? <laughs> or live like it's your last day? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They just figured that out, I think, because we normally come here every year and this not a lot of people here, but today I see a lot of Guyanese people. Normally it's just me and Krishna here. <laughs> so we got bad now, we got bad now. Yeah, yeah. Alright, cheers, cheers. But the Guyanese, them are high, them are high. Alright, you having fun so far? Yep. Alright. Well, fun. Continue to enjoy. Bottoms up. I'm going to continue to babysit you, right? And take it light, of course. Yeah, you better. And oh my god, I haven't drinking nothing, no alcohol or anything in two weeks, so. Alright, so bed in, bed in. I'm bedding in. Alright. You'll be alright, don't worry. I'm here to take care of you. Thank you. Cheers. Let's go have some more fun. And family, come, let's have fun together. Yeah, man, if you get wine with you at home, then cheers, cheers. cheers take cheers. one, right? Take one, take one. Yes, yes, check it out, check it out. This is the perfect weather here for wine fest. Not too hot, right? Yeah, yeah. Otherwise, it'll be too uncomfortable. So, nice weather, nice weather. Real nice. So, look what's going on to get the wine here now. Look, line right to be wrong. I guess we gotta hurry up and join online. Otherwise, we're gonna get more wine here tonight. We're gonna left high and dry. Yep, a lot of line, a lot of line. Everybody's making the most of it. So good, good. Good festival.
How you feeling? How you feeling? <laughs> Look what's going on here, a lot of craziness, craziness. Outdoor festival. And they set up a food line. I'm surprising all these people. Yeah, man, nice, nice, real nice. Real nice atmosphere, right? Look what's going on here. Good time, you're having a good time? Amazing time. Cheers, cheers. Cheers, cheers. There we go. Bottoms up, bottoms up. Follow cause I want gas yeah. 